So we're standing out of the X Factor, about to go in tonight. From last night, who are your favorite performances? Uh, Alona Santiago, she's my favorite. Yeah, yeah, definitely Alona or Kaya Cohen. She's she was amazing, and I just like her voice a lot. Right. Yeah. I'm rooting for Tim too. Tim, Tim Olsad. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, he might be in the lower bottom half. So, like, I want. I also want to know what do you guys think about Carlos going home last night? Are we okay with that? Or um, I'm fine with that. Yeah, I was. I mean, he has a good voice, but I wasn't too much of a fan of Carlos. Yeah, yeah. I was more worried for people like uh, Alona or Kaya going home, uh, or like the groups. I like the groups a lot. I was okay with Carlos going home, honestly. He was, like, he his audition was great, and, you know, he was pretty inspirational, but at the same time, he was kind of getting a little boring, in a sense, or uh, I don't think Paulina was taking him the right direction either. I love Rachel Potter. Even though she's, like, over 25, she's freaking awesome. I loved her um, rendition of Alone. And then Demi Lovato's comment after him, she was, like, still better than Carrie Underwood. Although Carrie Underwood is my favorite. But I, I, I have to say, her rendition was kind of better than Carrie Underwood. So say Rachel wins all of the X Factor, do you think she has a chance at becoming one of the next Carrie Underwoods? I, I honestly, I think Rachel Potter can win this. Even though we're kind of like both at Sweet Suspense, but... They can't, <laughs> so I, wait, what do you guys love about Sweet Suspense? I just like girl bands for some reason. Like, Fifth I really Harmony. like Fifth Harmony. Yeah. Okay, and they're here tonight. Are you guys super stoked? Yeah, we're super. he's been to like every yeah. Fifth Harmony show. I was, <laughs> it's just a, like it's pure coincidence the fact that they're showing up today. Well, you're just telling me that you're Alex and Sierra fans. Tell me all about it. Did you like the performance last night? I think it was one of their rougher ones of the competition, but they're still my favorite. Yeah, they are still my favorite. Even if you know last night it wasn't what we expect, but the past, the the past, since the yeah, since the beginning, I just love the chemistry between them and how you know they look all sweet together. I I just love them. They're strong as a couple. Like they they get to like they pull each other together and they just they go through with it. All right. Well, how do you guys feel about Carlos going home last night? Are we okay with that, or do we think there was anybody else deser that deserved to go home before him? I was really sad that Carlos left because I thought he was really awesome. Yeah, I just thought that Carlos was one of the best, and I thought he was going to make it till the end. Right. Well, two people are going home tonight. Who are our predictions for the people that are getting eliminated? Mm, Kaya and Sweet Suspense. Okay. Um, I think Carlito, and I don't want anybody else to go home. Well, I mean, Carlito has had three rough rows in a week, so I think that's a good one, but I want to know why you think Kaya should go home. What don't you like about her? I like her, but I think she just struggled the last two weeks. So who are our favorite contestants on The X Factor right now? Alex and Sierra, hands down. Me too. I thought they struggled a little bit last night, though. I still love them, but what are we feeling going into tonight's elimination? I think they'll still make it up to next week, but I, I liked last night's performance, actually. Even though they kind of did a little bit something different, I think it was a good change that they made. Okay, the I just like when they have the chemistry together. I would never separate them, but I'll let you be on that one. Okay, so number one person who's winning the whole competition. Ooh, um, I hope Alona will win, but I don't. I think uh, um, Potter. What's her first name? Um, oh, Rachel Potter. Rachel Potter. Yeah, she has some pretty good pipes, so I think she might win. Yeah, I, I'm rooting for Alona or Kaya, but I think Russell Road might win. I want to know favorite moments from judges last night. I mean, there were so many different like funny comments. What do you, what's really stood out, stood out to you? I love when uh, Kelly was told like. When basically called out Simon the fact that he didn't have anybody that could like hit a note right. on his team, which is like totally true, but still, I was like, freaking Kelly has that sass and she brings it to the table. Kelly, Kelly's my favorite. Yeah, I love Demi and Simon. The, oh, yeah. the chemistry is amazing. Yeah. So, yeah, so it's, last night they decided to put them next to each other again. So I just think it's absolutely amazing. What do you love about Kelly? Uh, just her facial expressions, how she gets into it, her reaction. She's always either like very excited about it or like she's very, you know, honest about what she thinks went wrong or they can I, improve on. I feel like she's actually devoted and cares about her contestants, where some of the other judges, they might care, but not as much as Kelly. True. Very true. I liked when Simon said that the rest of the judges were witches. I thought it was funny. <laughs> yeah, I just think it's funny when the girls team up against Simon. Yeah, I love it. Demi's the best especially, right? Yeah. Yeah. How about Demi? Do you guys, she got sat next back, or back next yeah. to Simon yesterday. Yeah. How do you guys think the chemistry between them is? I love the victory between both of them it's, it just brings finally like some like humor to the show and i really like the fact that the, there's a part where she's at like oh 80s just like simon's age i just found that and they showed the picture of simon i was like classic classic demi who would you choose if you were on the x factor and you had a choice for mentors oh man uh if kelly Rowland's still around i would probably choose her okay
I think Simon, because he's been doing it the longest and he has all the tricks of his sleeve. So yeah, probably Simon. He has the power to make you something big afterwards. And I heard you sing. Do you want to give us a little like clip it? Sure. I'll sing a little One Direction since they're from X Factor. When he opens his arms and holds me close tonight It just won't feel right Cause I can't love you more than this Yeah Where can we find your music? You can go on YouTube, Sid XOXO22 Or just search Sydney Alton And my new music's coming out next month